friends, welcome to KVR Maths Academy. In this video, let's discuss 3 and 4 graphs in question number 3 in exercise 3.2 in polynomials of 10th class mathematics. Right? So, before discussing this topic, friends, please subscribe my YouTube channel, those who are not subscribed yet. Thank you. Yes, let's go through this. Yeah. See, this is the third question. Third graph in question 3. P of x is equal to x square minus 4x plus 5 has given. So, P of x is equal to x square minus 4x plus 5. So, let us take y is equal to x square minus 4x plus 5. So, first uh, find the values of uh, ordered pairs. After that, let us find, let us draw the graph on graph sheet, right? Yeah. See, first take x value, y value and ordered pair x comma y, x coordinate, y coordinate, right? Yeah. See here. Mm. C first minus 2 minus 1 0 1 up to 2, eight, two take yeah minus 2 substitute here y is equal to minus 2 whole square minus 4 into minus 2 plus 5 right yeah minus 2 whole square is 4 plus 4 minus into minus plus 4 2 is 8 plus 5 this is 4 plus 8 is 12 plus 5 is 17. Yes, 17. This is minus 2 comma 17, right? This x coordinate is minus 2 and y coordinate is 17. Next, substitute minus 1 in the place of x. y is equal to minus 1 whole square minus 4 into minus 1 plus 5. That is 1 plus 4 plus 5. This is 10. Isn't it? Yeah. So, 10 we have got minus 1 comma 10. A substitute 0, 0, 0 plus 5, 5 only. So 0, 5. Next substitute 1 here. That is equal to 1 square minus 4 into 1 plus 5. That is 1 minus 4 ones are 4 plus 5. 1 plus 5 is 6, 6 minus 4 is 2. We have got 2, 1, 2. Next substitute 2. Y is equal to 2 square minus 4 into 2 plus 5. That is equal to 2 square means 4 minus 4 2 is 8 plus 5. 4 plus 5, 9, 9 minus 8. 9 minus 8, yes, 1. This is equal to 1. 2 comma 1. So it has not cut the x axis, no? So take another value 3. y is equal to 3 square minus 4 into 3 plus 5. That is equal to 3 square is 9 minus 4 3 is 12 plus 5. So 9, 9 plus 5 is 14. 14 plus minus 12. 2 only has come. So it has come 2. 3 comma 2. So I think it has a increasing, increasing these uh, y coordinates now. Y coordinates are increasing. I think it has not cut the x axis. It has not cut the x axis. Let us check in the graph itself. Right? Yes. First, it uh, note it down. After that, I will explain this whole problem on graph sheet. Right? Yes. Note it down. P of x is equal to x square minus 4x plus 5. Right? So, these are the values x, y, x comma y. So, these are the values what I have taken on the board only. I have, ta I have taken here, right? Yes. Uh, so, for constructing graph, I have drawn coordinate axis. Uh, first one is x axis and uh, second one is y axis. Intersect at uh, 0, 0, 0, that is indicated by O, right? So, let us look at the points on the graph. Yeah. Look here. So, on x axis, 1 centimeter is equal to 1 unit only. I have taken C. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, like that, minus 1, minus 2, minus 3, and so on. On y axis, 1 centimeter is equal to 2 units I have taken. 2, 4, 6, 8, like that. Here, minus 2, minus 4, minus 6, so on, like that. Yes, let us plot the points now. Yeah. See, first one is minus 2, comma 17, right? Yeah. Minus 2. On x axis, minus 2. On y axis, 17. See, this is, the, this is 16. This is 18. In between this middle of the point, 
there will be 17 right so this is minus 2 comma 17 isn't it yeah next one is minus 1 comma 10 minus 1 comma 10 see minus 1 here 10 where it will be this is minus 1 comma 10 right yeah next one is 0 comma 5 on x x uh, on a x coordinate is 0 and y coordinate is 5 0 x coordinate 0 y coordinate is 5 now so this is 4 and 6 in middle of these points there will be 5 right yeah 0 comma 5 this one next one comma 2 1 comma 2 this one yeah next this is 2 comma 1 2 comma 1 here right 2 comma 1 yeah next uh, 3 comma 2 3 comma 2 right suppose if you take uh, another value 4 so how much uh, will you get 4 means 4 square minus 4 for the 16 plus 5 5 will come right so 4 comma 4 comma 5 will be of course so 4 comma 5 4 here 5 this will be isn't it yeah now join all these points see So, this is the graph which we required, right? So, here this curve does not intersect the x-axis, right? Does not intersect the x-axis, that's why it has no zeros. That's why it has no zeros, right? So, this is the graph of x square minus 4x plus 5. This is the graph of x square minus 4x plus 5. First, write down scale. Scale on x axis on x axis 1 cm is equal to 1 unit right yeah on y axis 1 cm is equal to how many units 2 units the exams itself we should uh, write a scale also otherwise we loss of mark right yeah here it, it does not have any zeros no let us justify our answer let us check here let us uh, verify verification let us do here let us find a delta here delta means what is the delta discriminant of the given polynomial what is the discriminant b square minus 4ac b square minus 4ac means here here ax square plus bx plus c only now yeah here a means b square means yeah b is minus 4 minus 4 whole square minus 4 into a how much not there anything means 1 into 1 into c c5 right so minus 4 whole square is yes how much 16 plus 16 minus 4 5 is a 20 that is equal to minus 4 have come so minus 4 is less than 0 no minus 4 is less than 0 so that's why it has no real roots that's why it has the polynomial x square minus 4x plus 5 has no real roots. That's why it does not intersect the x-axis. Have you understood clearly? Therefore, the given polynomial has no real roots. Understood clearly? Yes, note it down. Next, fourth graph in question number 3. P of x is equal to x square plus 3x minus 4. So, let us take y is equal to x square plus 3x minus 4. First, I uh, will find the ordered pairs. After that, I will draw graph and graph sheet, right? Yeah. First, take x value, y value and um, x comma y, right? Yeah. Look here. Listen carefully. See, this is first, uh, uh, yes, up to minus 4 I have taken. So, something differently we will take, right, minus 4. So, y is equal to, y is equal to minus 4 whole square 
plus 3 into minus 4 minus 4 right minus 4 whole square means 16 minus 12 minus 4 here write down this is 16 minus 12 minus 4 this is 0 so we have got 0 this is minus 4 comma 0 right yeah next uh, suppose minus 2 take y is equal to minus 2 whole square plus 3 into minus 2 minus 4 this is 4 minus 6 minus 4 4 minus 4 get cancelled this is minus 6 so minus 6 we have got minus 2 comma minus 6 right yeah next is 0 take then if you substitute 0 0 0 this will be minus 4 yeah so 0 comma minus 4 it will be next take suppose uh, 1 take y is equal to 1 square minus 3 into 1 minus 4 plus this is plus only now so this is 1 plus 3 1s are 3 minus 4 1 plus 3 is 4 4 minus 4 0 so next 1 if you take 1 0 it will occur 0 so 1 comma 0 so already it cuts the x axis right yeah so take another value enough say take uh, 2 2 means y is equal to 2 square plus 3 into 2 minus 4 4 plus 3 2 is 6 minus 4 this is 4 4 get cancelled answer is 6 so if you take x is equal to 2 you will get 6 2 comma 6 have you under, have you understood about this yeah so from this data i'll draw graph on graph sheet right note it down 3x minus 4 p of x is equal to x square plus 3x minus 4 these are the values uh, which i have taken on the board right yeah see here for using this data i'll draw the graph on graph sheet right see here i have taken coordinate axis one is horizontal axis is called x axis and vertical axis is called y axis see these two are horizontal and vertical axis intersect at oh this is 0 comma 0 here 1 2 3 4 5 6 minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 so on like that here y axis on y axis also like this only i have taken 1 2 3 4 5 like that minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 so on like this right so let us uh, locate these points first one minus 4 comma 0 minus 4 on x axis y minus 4 and y, y coordinate will be 0 so this will be here right minus 4 comma 0 next minus 2 comma minus 6 here minus 2 and minus 6 minus 2 and uh, y coordinate is minus 6 only now so come here so this is minus 6 right minus 2 and minus 6 next 0 comma minus 4 0 x coordinate is 0 y coordinate is minus 4 which means on y axis only so this is 0 comma minus 4 right yeah next one 1 comma 0 see 1 comma 0 here will be na 1 x coordinate is 1 and y coordinate is 0 that's why this point on the x axis right next 2 comma 6 2 comma uh, x coordinate is 2 and y coordinate is 6 so 2 comma 6 right so this will be graph join all these points how it will be see i am joining these points so the graph will be like this it is a shape of it's exactly parabola right understood clearly this is the shape of parabola this is the what is the graph yes x square x square plus 3x minus y 3x minus y this is the graph uh, scale also write down scale on x axis 1 centimeter is equal to yes one unit only we have taken next on y axis on y axis 1 centimeter is equal to 1 unit right yeah so here this curve intersect the x axis at two points that is minus 4 comma 0 and 1 comma 0 
Now the zero values of the given polynomial will be the zero zeros of the given polynomial will be minus four and one. So it is not y; it is four, isn't it? Four it is x square plus three x minus four. So here the zero values of the given polynomial is minus four and one, isn't it? Yeah. So let us uh, check verification. Verification by actual factors method. So x square here p of x should be equal to zero. No, zero of the polynomial means so p of x is x square plus three x minus four is equal to zero. So what are the factors of four? Four ones are four, two twos are here. Three must come now. So four ones are four. We have to take x square plus four x minus x minus four is equal to zero. Isn't it? So 4x minus x is my plus 3x only now. Yeah, here in these both, what is the common? X is the common. X plus 4. Again in these both, minus 1 is the common one. X plus 4 is equal to zero. Yeah. So again, x plus 4 do common. The remaining part is x minus 1 is equal to zero. So here x plus 4 is equal to zero, and and x minus 1 is equal to zero. X is equal to minus 4 and X is equal to one. So the zero values of the given polynomial is minus four and one. Here from the graph also we have proved minus four and also one. So have you understood? Now write down. Therefore, the zeros, zeros of the given polynomial, polynomial are minus four and one. Have you understood clearly? Yes, note it down. Okay, friends. If you like my video, please like and share. Don't forget to subscribe. Thank you. Thank you very much.